Hello guys, my name is Evans and uh, welcome to this um, last part in this uh, video tutorial for the October-November 2017 IGCSE ICT paper 2. Um, in the last couple of videos, we've done sections from document production, um, we've done data manipulation, we've looked at mail mage, and um, we started looking at um, PowerPoint in the last video. So we're supposed to start with step number 35, okay? So step 35 says that uh, create a pie chart using the data in the file n17 pass. Uh, pass number um, dot csv and um, the chat should show the number of passengers by region for 2019 only okay so let's uh, get this uh, this file open it and we are getting the regions so north america europe and rest of africa and only information for 2019 okay okay so that is that is what you can get um if you want to include the headings uh, or the um, the access titles, you can include them later on. Okay, but that should be fine. So next we need to, well, for a pie chart, we don't need access titles, uh, my, uh, pardon me. Um, so insert um, a pie chart and you choose a, a 2D pie chart. Um, so a 2D pie chart and then um, next step, it says label the chart with a title and this is the title for the chart so i'm just going to copy this um copy it and paste it on the chart as the chart title um, using excel so copy it paste it here okay and then um you are going to go to the next step step 37 all right so pardon me my wife has just walked in uh hi good to see you <laughs> all right thank you all right so let me just uh, uh wind up the video my wife has come to see me how excited i am <laughs> she's come by my office okay um so step 37 says um um display a legend okay um so display on each sector only the percentage values okay so what we're going to do is get here the legend is already there at the bottom but um, if you want you can change it uh, at any position that you want okay so um, if you want you can put it on the right you can put it on the left that's fine whichever um, you choose but also on the data labels we need to uh, to go on more options so that we display the percentage values okay so um we're just going to show the percentages like that according to the question. So it says um, display a legend and display on each sector only the percentage values. So that's what we have done here. We've just displayed only the percentage values. So the next question says place the chart to the left on the bullet points on the slide with the title Worldwide Cruise Passengers. So um, you go back here, copy this chart. Okay, so just copy it and go to the PowerPoint slide that you were working on and find um, um, worldwide cruise passengers and you're supposed to place the chart on the left so what i'm going to do is to drag this this site and then paste the chart uh, here okay so that's um that's fine um we paste it as a, as a picture that should be fine okay so i'm going just to in, enlarge it a little bit so that it's um clearer okay that should be good all right so next um set the slideshow so that it loops continuously on screen okay so that would be step number 39 okay so so you need now to set up your 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 slideshow so set up slideshow and make sure that you check this part so um tick it so that loop continues until escape is pressed and this part says place no evidence document screenshot showing your method and so i'm just going to capture this screenshot here and copy it and say okay and then go to um, the evidence document and paste it under step 39 good all right so the next step says save the presentation okay the print the presentation and hand as handouts with six slides to the page and uh, print those handouts um rather print these handouts make sure that your name center number can number um, appear on all the slides. So let's just verify that our name, candidate number, and center number appear on every slide. 
and um, we are going to go ahead and print this as a handout so go to print and under full page slide select um, six slides okay that's fine and go ahead and print it just like that okay then um, the other part says print only the slide with the world uh, worldwide cruise passengers make sure that this slide fills um, the full page okay so also you ensure that your full your details are there so this is the um, slide um, where we're supposed to print in full so go to file and print and then check this part now that is on full page slide and um, um, you can go to um, to let's see which slide was that supposed to be this slide so i don't know if i change to current slide okay so this is the slide that we're supposed to print in full as it is so go ahead and print it now then uh-huh so we are done i think now so that's your total 10 max then what you just need to do now is to print out your evidence document um to save and close your evidence document all right so this has been the october november 2017 igcci city paper 2 exam and I hope you guys are going to do well in your paper tomorrow. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, to subscribe, to comment, and also just to um, enjoy my channel. All right, see you uh, in the next papers.